Welcome to Geography in a Minute. Today's topic, the Tunguska event. On June 30th, 1908, an explosion occurred over the sparsely populated eastern Siberian taiga in Russia. Witnesses described a bluish light nearly as bright as the sun moving across the sky, then a flash and a billowing cloud closer to the horizon, then finally a pillar of fire. About 10 minutes later, there was a loud explosion. The shockwave accompanying the explosion knocked people off their feet and broke windows hundreds of kilometers away. The blast was detectable as far away as the United Kingdom, the Dutch East Indies, and Washington, D.C. Because the site is remote and instrumentation at the time was not as advanced as what we have now, there are not many contemporaneous measures available that would tell us more about what happened. There are a few eyewitness accounts, taken 22 years after the event by the scientists investigating it. This scientist, Leonid Kulik, theorized that the explosion had been caused by a giant meteorite impact. On the first expedition to the blast site in 1927, no crater was found. Instead, a zone roughly five miles across had trees scorched and devoid of branches leaning away from an apparent blast site. Decades later, scientists theorized, based on mineral deposits at the site, that it was likely caused by a meteoroid airburst, which occurs when a meteorite traveling through Earth's atmosphere burns up or explodes before reaching the ground. Estimates of the impact size range from 3 to 5 megatons of TNT. 